Hello beautiful people, I hope you're doing well and welcome back again to On How Channel. And for people that don't know, my name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in a comment. I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back. You already know, if you have any questions as well, make sure to drop them in a comment. I will be happy to make a video for you too. Same as the over 100 videos I made now on Shopify customization. All the little things, no, no matter what you're trying to do on Shopify, just check out my channel, you already find it. I already made a video for that subject. And I don't know what the subject is, but I know I already made a video about it. So <laughs> anyway, and in this video, I will show you how to hide the header menu to the right on your Shopify store. And this is really handy for people that use a different language other than English. And this is especially with Arabic. Because if you Arabic, it starts from the right to left, not like English, starts from the left to right. So having the menu, header menu, I mean, on the right is really good if you're using Arabic language or other languages that starts from the right to left. So that's really important. And I noticed there is no videos or information how to do that, but no worries. I got a request and here I am making the video. So as I said, in this video, I will show you how to move the header menu to the right on your Shopify store. And we will do that by a single line of code, no apps, nothing like that. So without any more talking, let's just jump to it. As you can see, this is the Shopify dashboard in here and I have down team, the last version 15, as of now. But below it here, I have a lot of teams actually, like taste, sense, refresh, spotlight, and trade. And if you are wondering why is that, because each trick I do share on my channel, I do demonstration on the video on down team, the last version, but I also do it behind the scenes on taste, sense, refresh, and other teams as well. So if you're not using down team using one of these, it should work for you just fine. And even if it didn't, just drop me a comment. I will be happy to help you out. So as I said in this video, I will show you how to move the header menu to the right. So let me show you what I'm talking about. So for example, in here you can see on the left and there is no option on the team customizer for the header to change the menu uh, place, I mean position to the right or something. There is no option to do that. So even if you change the language to Arabic, it will still be here. So in this video, as I said, I will show you how to uh, actually move the header menu to the right. I will not change the language. I would just change the menu uh, position to the left, to the right, sorry. So let's just keep this page open. We will do the trick and come back and see it. By the way, if you are interested in how to change the color for the bubble count on the card, Make sure to check out my channel. I already made that video. So let's just keep this and get back in here. The first thing you're going to do is, as always, click on the three dots for left of customize and click on edit code. It will take you to the code editor. And again, I have to mention this in each one of the videos because I keep getting the same comment again, which is either base.css or team.css or style.css. It's gonna be one of these. In my case, I know it's base. So click on the the top left corner for the search bar and simply type in base if you cannot find it type in base uh, team sorry if you cannot find it type style so it will be either base.css team.css or style.css mine i know it's base here we go so it's base and it will be in assets folder as you can see so let's just click on it and here we go so we need to scroll all the way down it's a huge file let me drag this here we go. So in here we need a, a new line because we're gonna paste in code in here and simply click front of the closing bracket, hit enter, and we are in completely new line. And because as I said, we will paste the code. In order to get code, you need to hire a developer, pay him and wait 24 hours and he will get back to you with the code. In this case, you don't. Just scroll down the description box and you will see a link named as code. Simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here with very short code that will do the trick. And again, this code is completely free. No share please, no pay please, nothing like that. Just a like button if this video helped you out and I would really appreciate it. So obviously what you need to do is select the whole thing. Make sure to select even the closing bracket, otherwise it will not work. Right click and copy. And we will get back in here and simply paste it at the bottom of the page in the space that we did create. So let's just do that. And after that, we will simply click on save button, couple of seconds, it should be saved. Now we will get back to uh, Shopify store, reload the page and the menu, ta -da! as you can see, it's on the right now, as you can see. And if you wanna switch them over, like bring the contact that's here, I think you already will know what to do. Simply head to the navigation on the team customizer and simply uh, replace them over or switch them 
and it will be in the right position that you want to be. So that's how you actually move the header menu to the right on your Shopify store without using any apps or anything like that. If you have any questions, make sure to drop them below. But for now, I think my job is done. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.